The procurement process of the first 65 km section of the Madang Bramu Road will soon be completed. Madang Open MP Nixon Durban made this statement following his visit recently to inspect the 195 km of road from Madang Airport to Water Eyes. The 195 km is the length that the Department of Works have recommended for major maintenance. Sheila Malkin reports. Mr. Duban commended the Works Department for the initiative to allow light maintenance, giving the general public access to the highway. I am satisfied that the uh, road is in a very bad condition. It is not accessible by public and structurally it's fragmented and needs an urgent intervention. While doing the temporary maintenance, the rain is also causing problems for the road users. Mr. Duban said, with the understanding that the national government will intervene, the procurement process of the first 65 kilometers is near completion and it will ensure there are three contractors for each section that has been earmarked. And those three contractors will concentrate on 65 kilometers each. So we're looking at quality, control and competition amongst those three contractors. And I believe uh, through the concurrence of the Prime Minister, uh, we have not considered funding this particular section based on the assurance by the Australian government that they will take care of this part of the road. So far, this commitment has not come good. We have inquired on the commitment made during the days of the asylum seekers negotiation. Those commitments have not come good for our people. As a result, the government has decided to take another intervention to now look into another way to raise funds and fix those sections that are now affected. He made an appeal to the people in Medeng and the general travelling public using the highway that the government will ensure the Medeng Ramu section of the highway is fixed before the end of this year. The structural Damages that are now being exposed are not going to cost little amount of money. They will require a lot of funding and a lot of feasibility studies have been undertaken. A lot of scoping have been done already. We are now set and that is why the first section of the 65 kilometers have been already tended. Sheila Malkin, NBC National News, Port Moresby.